Hi everyone, now you are standing near the plant nursery in our school. This nursery is built to allow students to learn germination of seeds. Behind me, uh, you can see five planter beds meant for edible vegetables growing. So these are, this is the area where the students plant the vegetable and when it is harvested, uh, it will be sent to the canteen to be cooked for, to become the vegetable of the day. Okay, so, um, and further out behind, you can see the enclosure of the plant nursery. That is the place where students are given seeds from MPARCS, um, from MPARCS program called the Forest Restoration Action Plan. So this program encourages uh, people to be involved in conserving endangered forest species. And in our nursery, we have facilities that will allow a successful germination of these seeds. So let me show you more in the actual plant nursery. So for the first enclosure in the plant nursery is this area. This is a place where it provides 70% shade environment. Over here, we can see uh, on my left, you see uh, germination trays like this. So uh, seeds are either given by MPARCS or students have been also collecting seeds from trees in the school and it will be germinated in this station. And you look at uh, the place above you, you can see the irrigation pipes and directly above you, you can see the nozzle head as well. So this nozzle will be able to give out uh, water mist which are gentle and suitable for the irrigation of young seedlings. If we leave it out uh, in the open, when it rains, it will, it, the raindrops will have a very bad impact on the young seedlings. So that is why such an uh, enclosure is necessary for germination of seedlings. And uh, on my right over here, you can see uh, some of these young saplings that have been planted from seeds by the students. And each of them uh, has a tag to show um, the conservation status of these uh, plant species. Some are endangered, some are locally extinct, uh, some are pretty common. And uh, once these plants are big enough, we will be bringing them out to the next station uh, outside this enclosure, which provides 50% shade, so slightly uh, more sunny. Um, and that is the place that we allow them to grow to uh, another height before we actually plant it out. Um, within the school or even in the nature parks and nature reserves. Let's head over to the other side. 